Hey guys, I'm back with another video. Uh, today I'm gonna to talk about some confusion that some people have uh, on two topics. One is intermittent fasting, and the other is in the ketogenic diet. Uh, sometimes when you do searches on the ketogenic diet, you'll see that it's an emergency state where your body is being stressed out. That is totally not true. I think the confusion is not understanding of how your body can adapt from sugar burning into fat burning Fat burning is a very efficient state. Uh, when you're burning fat, you're also uh, running on ketones as well. And your brain loves ketones way more than glucose. This is why so many brain conditions improve when you put someone on the ketogenic diet. Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, uh, epilepsy, all sorts of things. And then there's this condition called ketoacidosis, okay, which is a, a dangerous condition but very rare in diabetics, type one. It's, you're not gonna see this in a normal person that is healthy, okay? Because the word ketone is in ketoacidosis, they associate it being both the same thing and there, it's just a big confusion. Being in the state of ketosis is completely different than being in the state of ketoacidosis, okay? Completely different situations and you're not gonna develop ketoacidosis unless you're a type one and you're doing it incorrectly. And if a person starts doing healthy ketosis and eating keto-friendly foods that are healthy, uh, they will never in a million years develop ketoacidosis. If you're a type one and you're not regulating your insulin correctly and your blood sugars are out of control, well, that's when you're gonna experience problems, okay? Now let's talk about intermittent fasting. Uh, sometimes people think it's starvation, okay? I'm gonna use this dictionary, Macmillan Dictionary, just to define the word starving, okay? Uh, to suffer and die of hunger, okay? That's what starvation means. To deprive nourishment, it comes from the old English word steorphan, which means to die, okay? That's what starvation is. Fasting is slightly different. The definition of fasting is to eat little or no food or only certain kinds of food, okay? What happens when you starve is you already tapped out your fat reserve and now you're running on muscle protein and organ protein, okay? And then you eventually die. It has some side effects. When you're doing fasting, you're tapping out your glycogen reserve, your stored sugar, you're running on your fat fuel and your stored reserve of nutrients, and the benefit is you live longer. So when you starve, you die. When you fast, you actually live longer. Okay, and there's so many health benefits that occur when you're doing fasting. When you're starving, you're hungry. When you're fasting, you have no hunger. Why? Because you're running on your fat fuel. All right, guys, so doing a healthy keto plan is not a state of emergency. It's a very healthy, low-stress thing. And doing intermittent fasting is not starvation. All right, thanks for watching. So if you want more knowledge on how to create a healthy body, Subscribe now and get daily notifications. Daily notifications, that sounds weird. Well, I'll just remind you on a daily basis. How about that?